Hi, everyone. <laughs> I see a couple of people here. So as always, I'm going to give it just a couple minutes until, um, until we have a few more people before I launch into the full live stream. Um, I have a koala here because we're talking about Australia today. Um, okay, I see a couple of people. Hello, hello, few people. Um, so I know I'm starting a little bit early, guys. I have a plumber coming today. This is what happens when you have a ton of stuff that you're trying to get done before you leave. Um, I have people coming this morning, so I had to go live a little bit earlier. Um, and this is gonna be super short. So I am going to Australia on July 3rd, which is in four days. <laughs> um, and I'm super excited about it. Oops, sorry, I'll block that light out. Um, I'm super excited about it. And I realized that uh, now that I actually have all of my stops um, fully planned and organized, I should probably tell you guys where I'm gonna be. So those of you in Australia, I know drop bears are not real. <laughs> um, so anyone who is in Australia, um, if you want to come visit or if you are in in the places where these events are going on or you're nearby, you can come. Um, so I also recognize, let me see if I have a clock pulled up here. Okay, so I recognize that it's quarter to three in the morning on the east coast of Australia. Um, so yeah, sorry. Um, I know I should be doing this at a time that works for my Australian audience, but unfortunately this is the only time that works for my schedule. So this will be archived um, for those of you who are maybe uh, insomniacs and catching it, but realize that you really do want to fall asleep. Um, this will be up on my site so you can check. I will also be putting the details of my trip on Twitter, Instagram, and Facebook, so you can definitely um, check up on where I'm going to be when. And also, um, I will, of course, be tweeting about it, posting about it, and maybe doing a couple of videos while I'm there just for funsies because I do have some plans to go to some pretty interesting spacey places, obviously. Um, so yeah, there will be a ton of stuff about Australia while I'm there. Um, and also, regular videos, don't worry, I do have stuff. Oh, there's something on my shirt. <laughs> I do have stuff pre-recorded. Um, so so yeah, so let's just jump on in and let me tell you guys what I will be doing while I'm in Australia. So I, um, I'm starting at the Star Stuff 2 Festival up in Byron Bay. This is the second time this festival has happened. It's a conference convention. I'm giving a talk. Um, on I think it's on July 7th <laughs> um, the dateline thing always messes me up I, I leave the third and I land the fifth and lose a day it's always kind of nuts to uh, to try to schedule that so I will be at the star stuff festival in Byron Bay um, from July 5th to July uh, 8th um, and I'm giving one talk at 4 p.m. on the 7th um, I don't know I will put links in the description once this is archived to the events. I don't have the links off the top of my head um, because it's been a little bit hard to actually organize all of this stuff. But if anybody is going to be in Byron Bay or if anybody is going to that festival, that's where I will be for my first uh, my first trip or my first uh, leg of the trip. Okay, so then I am taking a couple days off to go to the Gold Coast because why would I not go to the Gold Coast? I've heard about it a lot. I've never been. I am I am dying to go. So I'm not doing any events while I'm out there. This is just um, a little bit of rest after the one big, you know, four days at a conference. Um, and I will be writing. So I'll just be there working. Um, and then a friend of mine and I are driving down to the Parks Observatory. Um, we had a major role to play in Apollo 11 seen it uh, yeah so I'm I will maybe I'll be probably probably won't have the data to do this, um but I will be giving two talks at the parks observatory um one of them is at sorry double checking my schedule here um I've got one Saturday night, the 14th of July at 6.30 in the evening. Um, it is a dinner, it looks from my schedule, that it is a dinner as part of a conference, so I'm not sure, I don't think that one is a public event. Um, that is the Saturday evening, and then Sunday morning um, at 11.30 in the morning, I'll be giving a public talk. Um, also at parks. So if you are in the parks area or Sydney and want to drive the three hours out to parks, I will be giving a talk Saturday night and also Sunday morning. Um, so beware of the giant spiders. Yes, I know. I'm aware that pretty much everything in Australia is trying to kill me. So I am a little bit afraid of going out into the wild and nature in Australia. Even the cities kind of freak me out because, you know, those spiders are this big. <laughs> okay, so um, 
Oh, sorry. So that is, uh, right. Okay. So that is actually, the event is the Astrofest at the C uh, CSIRO Parks Observatory. Um, so if anybody is in the area and wants to come, I will be giving two talks as part of Astrofest at Parks. So after Parks, I then drive to Campbelltown, which is just outside Sydney, um, or maybe it is considered a different city. I'm not, to I don't know if it's a suburb or if it is a, um, or if it's a, a proper out of town, I actually don't know, but I will be staying in Campbelltown for a couple nights, um, and I will be giving a talk. Um, the event time, I don't know actually what time my talk is for this one, it is part of the MacArthur Astronomical Society event at the Plant Bank uh, Mount Anan uh, spot. I'm not totally sure where this is, but it is an observatory. Um, so I will be giving a talk the night of July 16th out there. Um, the event time is listed as starting at 6.30. I am one of two speakers. The other is my very good friend, Jeff Notkin, whom some of you may know from Meteorite Men. Um, we're, we're, we're seeing, um, so I'm not sure what time uh, my, my uh, talk is, but it'll be that day at the event. Okay, and then I have a couple days in Sydney. Um, I will be giving a talk on July 17th at uh, Science at the Local at the Penrith Observatory. Um, so that is, from my understanding, okay, if Sydney is here, well, it's here, Campbelltown is here, and then uh, Penrith is up here. So if you're in the area at all, it seems like it would be drivable. I'm not totally sure. Um, but I will be giving a talk at um, 6.30 in the evening at, I believe it's actually at a pub. I'm not totally sure where all the events are because I am being, yes, at the Penrith Observatory. Um, I am being collected by people from my Airbnb, which is awesome. Um, so then that, yeah, that's at, uh, my presentation's at seven, the event starts at 6.30. Um, and then the next night on July 18th, I'll be giving a talk to the Western Sydney Ast uh, Amateur Astronomy Group. Um, I'm not totally sure where that event is actually taking place, again, because I'm being collected for all these things. Um, but again, the event time is at 7.30 and the presentation starts at 8. Um, so if anybody is in the greater Sydney area, these are things that um, you can get tickets to. I will be putting all of the links um, when I put up a blog post and all the stuff on my social. I will have links where you can get tickets to these events. Um, and then I have a couple days off in Melbourne, and uh, I don't actually have any formal events in Melbourne. Um, I'm meeting up with a local astronomy group that I know for dinner one night and then giving some school talks on the Friday, which is the, let me see a calendar, the 20th of July. Oh, nice date. <laughs> um, well, although I guess in Australia, technically it was the 20, it was the 21st, it was the moon landing date because of the dateline. Um, so yeah, so that is my, and then I'm off to Auckland for four days um, to sit quietly after a week of, or two weeks of uh, giving a lot of talks and doing a lot of tour stuff, um, to quietly write and visit another country because I've never been to New Zealand. Um, so that's the plan. It's um, it's not it's it's not as intense as the last, um, as my last tour of Australia a couple of years ago, which was similar schedule but multiple talks a day so this is a little bit lighter um so yeah while i am down there i will of course like i said be posting everything that i am doing and where i am so that you can get tickets um and i might try to see if i do know some people in various parts of the city try to do some meetups if you guys are interested at all um all of that will be on my twitter feed most likely that'll be the um the, the kind of the home base of organizing things just because it's a little bit easier to manage, I, I think. Um, so yeah, definitely keep an eye on my Twitter feed if you are curious to see sort of where I'm going and where things are happening that you can actually come visit at. Um, for those of you who will be there, I will not be selling books because I can't bring them with me because it's a little too intense. Um, but if you have a book and you want it signed, just bring it and I'll sign it. Um, I will be, I will have some light vintage space merch, just pins and stuff um, for giveaways if you are there as well. Um, I think that's it. I actually think that's it. I just wanted to, um, I... I had a, I had my apartment painted this past week. It's been, it's been almost two weeks of, of renovations in here. This is the sneak preview of the new color scheme. I'll show you guys once I get my, uh, get everything set up and all the art back on the walls. But um, 
I was easier to do a quick live stream and give you guys the update as opposed to trying to do a full video about it because I just don't have time. Um, so uh, that's the the basis or basics rather of my Australia trip. Um, I don't think I have anything else. If you guys have questions where I'm going to be or anything, you can definitely leave them in the comments below. I'll keep an eye on it for the next couple days to make sure that um, anyone who is local and who's watching this archived because you're in Australia and not awake at three o'clock in the morning, um, that I do answer your questions since you are the people that I will be seeing. Um, I think that's about it. I'm really sorry to everyone in Perth um that I won't be making it out there I actually did have a Perth stop originally because I've never I've never been to Western Australia and that would be the the last state that I haven't visited but unfortunately the event fell through and then I just couldn't make it work it was just too far to go for something that doesn't that wasn't going to be there for me so <laughs> um sadly I will have to make it back out to go see see Perth one of these days um so that's it that's it. Yep. It's a pretty quick tour. It's a pretty quick little trip. Um, three and a half weeks, but there's a lot being packed into it. Um, so yeah, I will put all the information. Oh, and sorry, I saw a bunch of questions. What am I talking about? Um, I'm giving two talks depending on the event. Uh, one is a talk. If any of you have been to Space Fest or seen me speak in the last couple of years, you've seen the dinosaur talk, um, which is all about the space plane that uh, America didn't know it needed before it got one that it didn't want. Um, oh, thank you, Sam, so much for your donation proving Australia exists. Um, it does exist. I will do some content from Australia and prove that it does exist. Um, I love it down there. Um, so I will be giving the dinosaur talk um, and I'm also giving a talk about um, women in space um, and sort of how how we made them from pilots to, to astronauts um, so yeah it'll be really exciting I am um, sorry I'm reading I'm trying to read a comment but it disappeared I'm so sorry um, I'll try to watch it if it I'll try to respond if I see it in the comments um, so yeah giving those two talks and um, that's about it it's, it's pretty casual I'm very excited um, and I hope to see some of you guys out there always come and say hi and um, those of you who are not in Australia I will see you via the internet from it I don't have anything else to say so I'm gonna go finish packing bye guys thank you so much oh yeah and of course follow me on Twitter Instagram Facebook to get the updates as I go along through Australia okay bye guys